hi this is mika and welcome back to my channel so today i want to talk about my cohort course excuse me so a lot of people always ask me um you know how do they start to get into overages or like what type of courses i offer so there's a few courses that i offer but the one that i um, that's probably like my best seller is uh, the overage cohort and so I want to get a little bit detail and tell you a little bit more about it so hopefully that you'll be involved I will be having my first one of the year in April and boy is there some good stuff on there and most importantly um, what I've learned through my process of doing overages is the first person that gets the list have a better percentage of getting the claimant to go with them before anybody else so I'm really excited to see what the results will be this time um, so basically to give you a little bit background or idea of what I do in my course it's pretty much a mastermind right so it's students from all over the US I pick the list and I wash the list well in this time I really don't have to wash it because nobody has the list yet um, I've discovered another way where you can actually get the list before anybody else so we would be the first people calling this list and then, um, so then I, I break them out, everybody gets their own individual claimant, and I pretty much walk you through the process. I lay out everything for you, meaning how to find the owner. A lot of times, some people that uh, they will DM me and they'll be like, oh, it doesn't work. And what I find is that a lot of newbies don't know how to look up the deed to find out the right claimant, meaning that if the new person purchases it and you're looking at the property on the overage list, nine times out of 10, it's the previous, not the new owner. So a lot of people make that mistake, number one. Number two is actually finding the address actually finding the owner um, name. So there's a lot of different things that go along with uh, doing the research in the cohort. And so that's basically what I'm teaching you is the process and the research that you need to find. As you'll probably see in one of my videos, I talk about all the things that are needed pretty much across the board, which is the APN number, the owner's name, the overage amount. Sometimes there's a tax uh, ID uh, deed and then the date of the auction and of course the overage amount. So basically I pretty much lay all the foundation out for you and give you all the tools and resources to be successful in finding the information and basically we go to work and we start, we try to actually file claims on an active live list. So that is my course in a nutshell for the Overage Cohort. Now, if you're not a group person and you don't like to work with people, um, I do offer a course where we do one-on-one -on -one and you pretty much are self-taught. You walk through the program on your own and we get on a call together and we talk one-on-one. -on -one. But the whole point of my cohort is to have accountability and so to make sure that you actually do the work and you come back into the group. I've had a lot of people um, in my groups partner with one another because what one of the things that I've learned is that where you may be weak at there may be someone else that it's their strength I mean I even had one student he made all the calls for the student so uh, I really like the camaraderie of the cohort because it's so many different people and we all come together and we find out each other's strengths and weaknesses and we work towards them however everyone gets their own claim so um, normally I assign about two to three just really depends that's why I keep my classes small because I want um, everyone to have enough to to actually understand the process. And the claims range from like 50,000 to 100,000. The 300 and the 400,000 I actually do as a group, as a bonus. So um, if you do all the work in the process of, it's a five week, um, well, it's a four week session, but it's a four week session, but there's five sessions. So there's only one weekend. So we do it once a week and one weekend day. And uh, pretty much that's it. That's just the course. And the whole reason why I do that, like I said, is for accountability and for us to know each other's strengths and weaknesses and hopes to work together in the path, in the future. And um, also too, I also have tax deed courses where those are also one-on-one -on -one, um, or you can do it yourself as well. So that's a little bit about my courses and to give you a little background about a cohort. The reason why I'm doing this video is because I'm having my first cohort of April and I'm really excited because this time I'm able to get a list that no one has already because I actually attended the auction. So no one's got the information yet. So I look forward to working with you if you want to learn the process on overages and fouling claims. 